We started with the design for it by looking at the wor the worst looking <laughs> real surgical aids because we wanted it to look real, but we didn't want it to look real. We, but they had to look like they could actually perform an operation. So we we pulled out every single medical catalog that we could find and looked at. Uh, every you know all the different surgical instruments that were around, the the worst looking ones tended to be dental ones for some reason, <laughs> and uh, we so we looked at some of those, and then we then we looked at parts of the body, like bones, uh, ligaments, um, different sections of the body, so that we could kind of incorporate the mechanical part of that and the the uh, body parts with it, so that they were sort of. Uh, amalgamation of the two. And then I had uh, uh, one of my dir art directors on that was uh, Peter Grundy. I think it was. he sat down and he did the sketches for it. And we worked with closely with that. And then we brought in a jewelry designer to, uh, to actually build them.